Tonight, parents speaking out after the arrest of a Boise Middle School teacher on charges of sex crimes with a minor. It's a story we first brought you earlier this week. Now our Christina Bautista talking to parents who say the arrest has them worried for their students' safety and making a big decision to protect their child. Following the arrest of a teacher from here at Fairmont Junior High School on Monday, we've began to hear from parents who are choosing to pull their students from this school due to safety concerns. They're more concerned with students having their phones out um, in class than they are concerned with students getting raped and molested. New information from Boise police regarding the arrest of the Boise teacher Eric McDermott's arrest has been released. Detectives now tell us the alleged crime involved one victim in 2020. Their follow up and investigation led to McDermott's arrest. Now parents from Fairmont Junior High are speaking out, worried about safety and are pulling their kids before the semester ends. I don't feel safe sending my child there, so I need to figure out what I need to do so that she can take her finals and go off to high school. The decision to pull out their kids' parents are saying was not made solely due to McDermott's arrest, but numerous incidents they say the school has handled incorrectly. It's, there is just a whole mixture of things not being done. And now it's come to the point that where somebody got raped. Parents are now considering homeschooling their kids, saying that's the only way they will know they are safe. Christina Bautista, Idaho News 6. This morning, Eric McDermott had his preliminary hearing, where McDermott's attorney requested for his preliminary hearing to be moved to next month. I came down to the Ada County Courthouse where I was able to review documents regarding his arrest. Mr. McDermott, you are excused. Fairmont Junior High School teacher Eric McDermott had his preliminary hearing moved to May 18th as requested by his attorney. Allow us time to make some decisions in this matter. As his lawyers prepare his defense, Idaho News 6 has uncovered new information about the accusations against him. Court documents say the victim was 16 or 17 years at the time of the attack in 2020. Police told us they were only made aware of the accusations this month. The documents also reveal the victim tried to resist, but the teacher allegedly forced him to have sex, also allegedly engaging in oral sex. Anything else we need to take up in this case? Nothing from the defense, Your Honor. Nothing from the state, thank you. We reached out to the Boise School District regarding the accusations made to the Fairmont Junior High teacher. A spokesperson did reach back to us saying that they need more time to answer our questions. Christina Bautista, Idaho News 6. We're learning more about who knew what and when following the arrest of a Boise School District teacher on rape and sexual assault charges. A Boise School District spokesperson says they were first made aware of the allegations against Fairmont Junior High teacher Eric McDermott on April 7th, which is the same time Boise police began their investigation. A police then arrested McDermott on the 17th. That same week, several parents told us the news of and reason for his arrest was a safety concern, and they planned to remove their kids from that school. At the time, the school district was not aware of any unenrollments, uh, but is now confirming that 10 students have been unenrolled from Fairmont Junior High School. This continues to be a developing story, and we will continue to keep you updated as we continue our investigation.